Welcome everyone, you may be wondering if you are able to remotely access your iPhone and five years ago the answer was yes but in 2023 the answer is no. So the simple explanation is Apple does not allow you to remote access but if you jailbroke the phone you could install this Sidia tweak called VNC and this would allow you to set up a VNC server on the iPhone and once you have done that you would be able to remotely VNC which if you're wondering is what you use to remotely connect to computers but it would also work for the iPhone. Now this VNC as you can see works on iOS 8 and older. On top of this jailbreaking you can't jailbreak the latest iOS 16. You can't even jailbreak the previous iOS 15. So jailbreaking doesn't exist anymore. But if you even wanted to use VNC on a jailbreak, you know, this VNC application is long unsupported. And so that is the problem. But this application does work. You can see the instructions, what you would need to do, and it will work. Now, if you are looking for an alternative solution, which works, but not well, there is this app called TeamViewer from the App Store. And in this application, you will be able to view some files from your iPhone remotely if someone connects to it. There is also the option to screen record. And when you're in the screen recording, the person who is remotely accessing Will be able to view your screen but there are two problems to this the first one is with VNC the phone can be off you can remotely access it and you know without any input you can fully control this iPhone you can unlock it you can click stuff you can you know swipe the screen everything but when you do this screen recording first of all your iPhone you have to manually start the screen recording so you can't just, you know, someone can't just connect automatically, right? And on top of this, someone has to swipe the screen of your iPhone with the VNC. When you're connected via VNC, you can use the computer, uh, computer's mouse to swipe around. But with this team viewer, you can't. And there is nothing better than this, unfortunately. And so what that means is if you wanted to access your iPhone remotely, well, I mean, you have to you have to swipe the iPhone, so it's not very useful, and that's unfortunate that jailbreaking doesn't exist anymore. If it did, you could use the VNC, but nowadays it is long gone. I wouldn't even research jailbreaking because the VNC tweak doesn't even support the newer iOS. If you get very technical, you can jailbreak the iPhone X still on the latest iOS 16, uh, but I would not recommend it. And the VNC tweak doesn't work, so essentially you would be wasting your time. If you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye bye.